Welcome back to my channel. So today, I literally have nothing to talk about, but um, it'll come to me. A few moments later. Like, what do you do when you have no one to talk to? Like, it's like if 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 I could explain it, it's like the people that were in my life. I'm so I'm glad that they're out of my life, but it's like when are my new people coming? You know, like how long is this gonna last? Like. Are they coming anytime soon? Because I'm trying to go to Miami. Like, <laughs> no, but seriously. Like, I just want someone to that I can just travel with and, like, you know, just be my person. Like, I can talk to you and it can be genuine, you know? And I feel like I had that. And it's like, right now, it's like a pride thing. Because it's like, we had a falling out, but I really don't know, like, the truth of the matter. But I tried to text her before, and it was just, like, animosity. So, I don't know what to do. Because I have all the means to do what I want to do, but I don't want to do it alone. And I like being alone, like I love being alone, but it's like, I want someone, like at least one person. Like I literally have no persons. And I feel like you can do things alone, but I'm just not, like I feel like my genuine person is the person I'm supposed to do that with. Like, I've talked to so many people and I've had so many friends, but it's just like, I feel like I will know when that's the right person for me. Like, I don't have to force anything. Like, you know, like every friendship I've been in or every person I've been with, I always feel like I have to force something or like just try too hard to to make the relationship work and i only felt like i didn't have to do that with one person and we don't talk anymore so what do you do what do you do i just want people in my life you know some people want money and that's all fine but once you get money you see and you realize that money is not it. Like, money is not everything. Like, it's nice to be able to not have to worry about how you're gonna pay your bills, how you're gonna eat. Yes. But if you're in that alone, what is the point? Like, yeah, it's nice to be alone, it's great. Like, especially if you're an introvert, but you're not gonna want to do every single thing alone for the rest of your life. It gets old. Now that I'm like, not worried about money, it's like I just want peace and happiness and people. That's all I want. And it's annoying when I can't get it, but it's like, I have people that I could talk to, but it's just like, it would be forced. It wouldn't be genuine at all. I just feel like, I just feel like I haven't met my match. You know, like, I personally do not know if you will know when you've met your person. I don't know for sure. I'm just hoping that I will know. But I want to be able, like, when I meet my match, I want to say for sure, like, I know this is the person for me, you know? Like, friendship-wise, like, honestly, relationships, significant others, that's another relation, uh, another conversation. Right now, I'm talking about, like, friendship-wise. And I feel like I'm getting older, and it's like, 
everybody's already got their friends and has had best friends since younger ages and it's like i had that but it's just like i don't know like and it's just like it's gonna come again like i'm getting old <laughs> people are not looking for friends like i don't know people are looking for friends but it's like it's just very hard because you, it's like getting into a relationship if you were to get into a friendship right now and it's just like most of the time as you get older it's just like friendships are as genuine because it's just older and people are growing up having kids getting in relationships so it's just like hard to make time for friends it's like friends are extra around this age like as you start getting older friends become a side thing like oh i want to go out on the weekend i'm gonna call my friends up or oh let's take a trip i'm gonna call my friends up friends is like i'll talk to you when i can you know maybe a best friend is like an everyday type of talk thing but it's just like friends are not priority that's a good way to say it like friends and making friends and finding friends at this age is not well, as I get older, I keep saying at this age, cause it's like, I'm not kind of, I'm not there yet, but I'm getting there. Like, like I say 25 is when people start like, just thinking about settling down if they haven't already. So it's just like, yeah, I don't know. Not the bad gang, <laughs> the bad gang. Uh. My whole life, I have never had anyone tell me the right way to do things or the way to do things, like the way that society does things, like talk to people. I was never taught how to talk to people. Like, I feel like people aren't, we're not taught, taught how to talk to people, but we have relationships and like role models that we may look up to to see how you act in relationships, how you talk to people and things like that. And I never really had that. Like, I never really had anyone that I knew that was like in a good, like in a stable relationship or in a consistent relationship. Like, I can't tell you one couple that I know and could like mirror, you know, I'm just going off on a tangent. This is just, I don't know. And also, I push people away. Like, I was talking to this, 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 this. I was talking to someone. Like, it's been a week since I texted him back. I don't know. Like, I literally just stopped texting him. Like, I don't know. I don't know what's wrong with you. Like, I don't got it all. And, like, that's how I do everyone. Like, I literally just will stop texting you. And just never talk to you again. Can anyone relate? Like, what's our problem? And it's like, I don't want to hurt anyone. But that's just something that I do. Like, and I don't know why I do it. Like, I just convince myself that's not the person for me. And I just say, well, let's learn. And they was there for a reason. And then that was it. But I don't know. He just wasn't for, I know he wasn't for me. So. Thank you guys so much for just watching this little rant. I don't really know what it was, but hopefully you guys stay to the end. And I love you so much. Thank you for supporting me and loving me. And my channel is growing. I'm so thankful for my new subscribers. Thank you guys so much for joining my channel. And um, I'm just so grateful that you've seen something in me to make you want to subscribe and watch my videos. Don't forget to like and comment and subscribe and share these videos if you think that they will help someone that you may know or anyone. And um, give me advice on my situation. And um, I love you guys. And um, <laughs> not the bad yang. I'm so weird. Uh, YOLO. Um, 
I love you guys so much and thank you for just being here and being an outlet for me and letting me just say thanks when they come into my brain. Okay, bye for real. <laughs> See you guys in my next video.